Want to know what the worst types of videos are? Well, you've come to the right place. Well, right video, actually. I'm guessing none of you took any transportation to get to this video. But that does not matter because today we are going to get into the top five worst types of videos. Now, this video does come with some rules. Rule number one. No individual YouTubers like Station or Odision. These are going to be genres of YouTube videos, not just towards one channel. 2. Playlists are not included. Those are playlists, not genres of YouTube videos. And finally, rule number 3. I'm not allowed on this list because 1. That's a violation of the first rule. And second, if I was on here, I would probably be number four, number three, maybe I'll stretch it, I don't know. But let's get on with the video. At number five, we have reaction channels. Now, these aren't as relevant as they used to be when we put them on this list because, well, they suck. There are some good reaction channels, but there are some that, that you know, like Jinx, CJ, React Builders, that just don't add anything to the video they watch they just watch the video in complete silence do i think the people that do reaction channels are bad no not all of them but is the content bad yes and for the longest time this was seen as like the lowest common denominator of content to like be popular so that's why it's on this list you know it's honestly sad because no one does real pranks anymore like Aria, Jack Jones, etc. Most of them are fake, and like it's not even meant to be staged. That's the problem. So it's just taking the entertainment away, and the ones that are actually are real get loads of backlash. So just what's the point of it anymore, right? Now I have nothing else to say. Let's move on. Excuse me, you got the time. Yeah. Number three is mukbangs. Look, I don't get it. I don't get why people want to watch. Other people eat tons and tons of food and get nine, get type nine diabetes. Like honestly, it's I don't see how it's considered entertaining. Other than if it's like an occasional side memory mukbang, but other than that, it, it's disgusting and it's not really good for your health to be doing mukbangs. Like the food isn't even healthy and it's honestly just really disgusting. And I just don't see how stuffing your face with tons of food is really considered entertainment. So yeah, I'm done with this one. Now, I'm going to cut the music and switch back to the run gameplay for this one, because most of the channels revolving around this genre are terminated. But it's like the proper traumatising, child-friendly videos that aren't actually child-friendly. They just use characters like Mickey Mouse to hide the facts that, well, they're disturbing as all hell. Like, I don't see how people could like this. It just seems really wonky. Like, look at this image. This is the dodgiest picture I've ever seen. This is meant to appeal to kids. Kids would find this disturbing as well. I mean, thank God most of these channels are done. And most of these channels don't exist anymore. But there are still Spider-Man slash Elsa videos out there. Which, if I were to watch, would give me retina damage and brain cancer. So yeah, it's not all that good. Anyway, now to number one. What could be worse than that? You know, I would have just found these videos to be bad if it wasn't for one thing. And that one thing is the exploitation of dead people. I'm sure we all know who J Station is. But there's multiple people who have also done this after he kind of like made the whole thing. But I think the biggest defenders are the ones who did it to Kobe. The video you're seeing on the screen right now was uploaded on the exact same day Kobe died and it was basically just trying to call him at 3am to prove that he's alive. And I don't need to go into detail of how toxic this is, you know. It's just terrible. Another example is uh, when Caroline Flack died around the same hour that she died. Some kid. And I think another person has done this. I, I've only known two people do this, but... Two people have called Caroline Flack after her death. Like, literally just trying to get, um, you know, 
popularity off of other people's death, exploiting death for views. And it's just, why? It's not going to make you look better. And anyone who watches these types of videos and gets enjoyment out of them should be thrown in jail. And anyone who makes these types of videos should be executed. I think doing this in no matter what country is a crime. And that is why it is the worst type of video to make on YouTube. Not just my least favourite, the worst. No argument. Well, that was a video. Hey guys, I'm back. Um, I'll be back with another video in about two or three weeks. I do have one prepared. So yeah, that's it. Um, if this video can at least get five likes, I'll call Jay Stason's career on my Nokia Talkman 600. So yeah. Bye. Leave.